Tau overflows. What happens when lotus of love is blossomed? Always remember to judge everything by your inner feeling of bliss and harmony, not through the logic. Love the person, but give the person total freedom. Love the person and from the very beginning, make it clear that you are not selling your freedom. You are sharing your love, your presence. When the lotus of love is blossomed, there can be no better blessing than that. What happens when the lotus of love is blossomed? Mind wants to know. Those who are within the inner circle of an awakened one, they will experience this on a moment to moment basis. As they progress, the inner lotus is growing, lotus of love is growing, many things begin to change in them. As a result, from 35 to 42, a new step, a new door opens in life. A new journey begins. It is up to the age of 35. You have felt, if you have felt deep harmony and orgasmic feeling and you have discovered meditation through it up to the age of 35. Then from 35 to 42, you will help each other go more and more into meditation without sex. Even if sex happens, it will be meditation. Because at this point, Sex, as you know, starts looking childish. The dimension, sex enters into a new dimension when it is, it has the element of meditativeness in it. You go deeper into it and explore deeper realms of it. The lotus of love has blossomed beyond the mud of sex and lust. This does not mean sex may not happen. It may or may happen, but its effect will be totally different. And if you observe your act of sex, it is no more sex, juvenile and immature. Instead, it is much deeper. After this, if you have loved a man or a woman, you will want to give the other person as much freedom as possible. If love gives freedom, if love does not give freedom, then it is not love. Love and freedom are two sides of the same coin. The journey continues. The age of 42 is the time when a person should be able to know exactly who he is or who she is. From 42 to 49, one goes deeper and deeper into meditation, more and more into himself and helps the partner the same way. Not only the partner, instead anyone who comes in contact is, he is helped in the same way. The partners become friends, travelers along the path of innerness. There is no more husband and no more wife. That time has passed. Husband and wife, they are connected to one another through the bond of sex. After that, when they are connected through the bond of love, or love has blossomed, emerged out of the mud of sex. Then they are connected to one another through deeper aspects of life and meditation. It has given its richness to your life. 
now there is something growing that is even higher than love that is friendliness a compassionate relationship to help each other go deeper into oneself this helps one to become more independent more alone it is just like two tall trees standing separate but is still close to one another getting the nourishment from the same source or two pillars in a temple supporting the same roof standing so close yet so separate and independent but their roots are rooted in the same place inside yourself try to look and witness the other is never responsible remember that is the mantra the other is never responsible from 42 from 49 to 63 this awareness becomes your focus of the being everything else in the world loses its meaning the only meaning that remains is with this aloneness from 56 to 63 you become absolutely what you are going to become the potential blossoms and from 63 to 70 you start getting ready to drop the body and its consciousness that is relating to the body now you know that you are not the body also you know you are not the mind glimpses of this comes earlier as well but this time it becomes deeper the body was known as separate from you somewhere around the time when you were 35 if life goes correctly by the time you attain the age of 35 you feel that a feel a kind of a separation from the body that the mind is separate from you was known around the time when you were 49 at 35 you feel a separation from the body at 49 you feel separation from the mind as well now everything else drops except witnessing self just the pure consciousness the flame of awareness remains with you and this is the preparation for death 70 is the natural life span for human beings and if things move in natural course then one dies with tremendous joy with great ecstasy totally fulfilled and evolved he feels tremendous immensely blessed that life's life has been has not been meaningless there is new meaning in life one has found his home and because of this richness this fulfillment one is capable of blessing the whole existence be around such a person just to be near such a person at the time of death is a great opportunity one can be enlightened the same moment you will feel as the person leaves the body as if some invisible flowers are falling upon you although you cannot see them but you can feel the flowers showering on you it is a sheer joy so pure that even a little taste of it is enough to transform your whole life when you are in the company of such a person who is alive and whose consciousness is not of the body not of the mind there is a blessing you feel every moment there is something changing growing and evolving in you enough for now